from Rocky Phoenix, one of the three guys that thinks he's the owner of the Baltimore Elite Wrestling Alliance. And we got a semifinal match for the United States title tournament between this man, Robbie Wayne, and Chris Slade. Robbie Wayne. Somebody just told Robbie Wayne. 20 degrees outside. I hope he doesn't think he doesn't do what I think he's gonna do. It's 20 degrees. But in typical Robbie Wayne fashion, he's not here to disappoint. Oh, he found a warm place to sit. He found a warm place to sit. He found a nice warm place to sit. It's February the 13th, but Robbie Wayne is here to entertain. Oh, and he found a special lady in the front row. Uh-oh. And we going on the down low. Uh-oh, what's he got in mind, folks? This kind of stuff you need Cinemax to see. And he's getting it. And he's getting it. And that's why you pay so much for those front row seats because you never know when you'll become a part of the action here in the BEWA. Holy shit. Robbie Wayne is hotter than his fucking fire stick, ladies and gentlemen, and the crowd's giving it to him. He's got to focus because Chris Slade is a former United States champion, and we're awaiting his entrance now at Vicious Valentine. Hey. And that's why them front row seats are so valuable, you never know. Oh! And here is the former United States champion, one of the longest reigning United States champions. Oh my god, it's history. so fucking cold! He's right. It's 20 some degrees. Oh, Chris Slade! Chris Slade heating up in Robbie Wayne's spot, ladies and gentlemen. Gentlemen, one of the most important things about Vicious Valentine today is crowning a new BEWA United States Champion. Chris Slade's held the title for quite some time last year. Robbie Wayne would love to leave Maryland with some BEWA singles goal, and here we go. Jockey in four position. Crowd's kind of split 50 50. We got a big show tonight. The winner of this match meets Reckless for the vacant United States title. We got Rolling Havoc, Eric Spade, and Bill Switch in a triple threat match for the Intercontinental title. But the main event, a tag team match for the Undisputed Championship. Commission members and technically great members Samuel Masters and DJ Carter will defend the Undisputed Championship against the new. Newly reformed, excessive force being Eric Merciless and Ace Anderson. But we'll get right back to the action here in the U.S. title tournament semifinal match. Here we go, here we go. Something's got to give, ladies and gentlemen. You know, it's about 20 degrees here at the BWA Arena, but these two crazy motherfuckers don't give a damn. Watch his shoulders on this. Slade's gonna try to power out of it. Alright. Here we go. Look at the torque. Look at the torque on these two athletes, ladies and gentlemen. 
They're fighting like the winner gets a sandwich. There we go. Notice the, the leverage that Robbie's maintained with the cinch lock. Oh! And Slade reverses it! Oh! That should be it, ladies and gentlemen, but Robbie Wayne gets a shoulder up at the nick of time. Then the match continues. What a takedown. You cannot turn your back away, Robin Wayne, for just one second. He's too quick for that. But Slade might be the quickest guy in the BWA roster. Here we go. Now he's got submission locked. Right in the middle of the ring. Ask him, Raf, ask him. These two gentlemen are setting the bar high for everybody else that has to wrestle tonight here at Vicious Valentine 8. And if you've been watching BWA television lately, you know that commission member WCW has absconded with the United States Championship. What happens when one of these individuals or reckless wins the United States title later? Will WCW hand the title over willingly? We got a cover a little slow on that. These two are putting on show, ladies and gentlemen. Here's the first of what I expect to be many kicks in this match, ladies and gentlemen. And Robbie Wayne is seeing stars, and Chris Slade is feeling it. Chris Slade is feeling it. He's got to get him away from the ropes, and I think he wasted too much time showboating and not enough time covering. And Robbie Wayne's able to get his shoulder up. Chris Slade, if he wants to win this match, he's got to stay on. No time for showboating. Stay on him. We got here for a little pile driver. That's Robbie Wayne. Oh, he landed on his feet. Running super kick. That's it. Robbie Wayne's going to the finals, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my God. And somehow, some way, Chris Slade kicks out of Not a bad idea. See, Robbie Wayne, he's staying with him. He's not giving him any rest. Constant pressure around his neck. Every breath is taxing. That wears on as the match continues. To defeat Chris Slade, one of the best high flyers in the BWA, you got to slow him down. You got to tire him out. And Reckless, I don't know where Reckless is right now, but he is eagerly awaiting the winner of this match. As he's received a bye into the finals after the event of the XNC Adam Maverick match. Oh, reverse And there he goes, showboating again instead of getting on him. Excellent move. He's got the legs. What's he going for here? We got ourselves a good old fashioned Boston Crab. Oh, look at the ring presence. Look at the ring presence. Robbie Wayne's got to make it to the bottom row. He got a fingertip on it. He's so close. Slay so trying to hold it. He got it. He got it. Robbie Wayne may have been moments away from giving up, but he got to the bottom rope and Slade is angry. What's it going to take? Both men are starting to feel it. Big blow to the head. And these are two of the most egomatic, charismatic wrestlers that the BWA has to offer. Oh! Heel kick and Slade is out. Oh, fouls it by Sting neck breaker. That should be it. Robbie Wayne. Oh, look at this. Bridge pin. Oh, and a reversal. And these guys are the three to find it with the human anatomy in the door. Robbie 
Dwayne's got to watch his shoulder here. Robbie's got to watch his shoulders here. He's going to try some in. The referee's got a good vantage point. And the winner, the winner of this match right now, Reckless. Because these two are going to wear each other out. That's two. Chris Slade trying to fight his way out of his taxi submission. He's got a flip. And down he goes. towards the outside. Oh, and you knew it was a matter of time. Is Chris Slade gonna fly? And nobody flies quite as high in the BWA than Chris Slade. Chris Slade is getting love from the BWA solar system. Robbie Wayne is knocked out on the concrete floor. And Reckless has to be licking his lips backstage. These two men are beating the hell out of each other. You know, Slade might have been able to keep Robbie Wayne out there and he might have got a count out victory. But Chris Slade doesn't want to win in that fashion. And how did Robbie Wayne kick out of that? High risk maneuvers, high risk but high reward if they can be hit. Oh. Robbie Wayne got a second win. Oh, and Slade finds his feet. Oh, man. And Chris Slade is moving on to the finals. He'll face reckless. Oh, and somehow Robbie Wayne kicks up. Oh, he's got on bar. He's got on bar. And Chris Slade is a long way away from the rope if he wants to force Robbie Wayne to break this submission. Look at the torque and the leverage Robbie Wayne is doing on his head. Robbie Wayne is in the fight of his life, but he still has the wherewithal to entertain the crowd. Watch his shoulders, ref! And he bridges out of that one. And he bridges out again. Front guillotine show code, ladies and gentlemen. Said a bunch of times, it's key to know that Reckless is going to face the winner later today. How much of either Slade or Robbie Wayne is going to be left when they have to face Reckless later today? It sounds like the crowd's on Robbie Wayne's side in this affair, which is strange because Christopher Slade is universally loved by the BWA Solar System. Got mixed reaction from the crowd. Some Slade fans, some Robbie Wayne fans. That should be it, folks. Robbie Wayne kicks out. 
Slade is feeling it. He's got to stay on him. No time for showboating. You got to stay on him. And the crowd is singing some sort of harmony that I don't understand or recognize. And Chris Slade is making a huge mistake. He's giving Robbie Wayne a lot of time to recover, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, basic standard level one first day of wrestling school DDT and he's pandering to the crowd why is he pandering to the crowd do they pay his own oh, Robbie Wayne made him pay Robbie Wayne made him pay Chris Slade you fucked up you don't pander to the crowd you stay on your opponent and he gave Robbie Wayne just enough recovery time. And Robbie Wayne, oh my God, Chris Slade kicked out somehow. And this crowd, ladies and gentlemen, they are behind. Sounds like Chris Slade. You got a chick in the front row. Oh, what do we got here, folks? Look at the brute strength. The brute strength by Robbie Wayne. And Robbie Wayne's going up top, baby. Robbie Wayne putting on a show. And he stopped him right in the chest. He, that's got to be it, folks. Robbie Wayne is won this match. And at the last second, the referee has a count of two, and the match continues. The crowd is giving it to both competitors. And what does Robbie Wade have in mind now? This is a precarious position, to say the least. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, did you see that? And that took it out of both men. Ladies and gentlemen, I couldn't think of a better match to kick off this is Valentine 8 than Chris Slade and Robbie Wayne competing for the right to advance in the U.S. title tournament. Spanish commentary provided by the BWA Solar System, ladies and gentlemen. Wow, I can't begin to describe what I just saw, but it was painful. The crowd's getting anxious as this match approaches the 15 minute mark. Wow, look at this! Look at that! And it was enough! What a great change! What a great reversal! And with the count of three, Robbie Wayne. And Robbie Wayne has defeated the former champion, Chris Slade. And somewhere backstage, Reckless can't wait to get his hands on Robbie Wayne. What a fantastic match to kick off. This is Valentine 8. And the show of respect by these two amazing competitors. Nothing. And Robbie Wayne advances. Robbie Wayne getting some love before he heads to the back. It's a quick turnaround because he's wrestling reckless later on today for the U.S. title. Only here at Vicious Valentine. And what a great match. Stay tuned because we are just getting started.